In this tutorial, we're going to cover the lines effect within X lights. So this is the icon for the lines effect. If I drop it onto the prop, and initially what we're getting here is just a line randomly moving around our prop. Now, the effect does support multiple colors. So if I put a few extra lines in just for now, if I put multiple colors in, you'll see that it supports all of those colors and it also supports the color curves. So you'll notice this line is changing color over time based upon our color curve setting. So let's go down the settings. The first one, as we see, increases the number of actual lines. I'll just set that to a high number. I'll just set it down to three. The next one is the number of points. So two points means it's just a straight line. Three points will make it into a triangle. If I can grab that. So you see now we've got three triangles going around. We want squares, but you know, I say squares, you know, uh, four pointed shapes, five points, etc. But die. Thickness will increase the thickness of the lines. Speed, as we would expect, will increase and decrease the speed. And then trails is will increase what is dragged behind, like a comet's trail. And then the fade trails is whether we have that three-dimensional type fade at the end of our trail. So there we go, that's the line effect in X lights. Until next time, see you later.